So hey y'all, I am back. I'm back, back, back with another video. So basically one thing I wanted to do was um, pretty much take the hair out of my knots. So I just took the hair out of the knots and this is in its natural state, but I wanted to go ahead and pretty much lay the wig down a little bit, do a little refresher for you guys, and also go ahead and press it out because I definitely want to wear my hair straight today or maybe like with a little curl. I don't know what I exactly want to do today, but you know how you do like a hairstyle? It's like, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm turning on all my hot tools because I just realized I didn't. But you know how you got a little style and it's like, girl, okay, I want to do something else with it. So that's what I'm going to do. So I'm just going to show you guys how transformative this hair actually can be. Um, this is the hair just out after I took the knots out. So of course it's going to be like a little bit curly and wavy, but I just want to take my little brush and just go through. So far, so good. I guess this also can be like almost like a about a week update because when I tell you the hair is very minimal shedding, pressing it has been like extremely a breeze. Like it wasn't hard to press the hair at all. And then even with taking the knots out and brushing it out, it isn't any really tangling or anything you guys can pretty much see. It just looks very effortlessly pretty. Lace is still holding on, but I'm not gonna lie. Um, I want to go through and re-up the lace, freshen up the lace, chow, give y'all a little vibe. So I wanna freshen up the lace. So some today I'm gonna definitely use something new. Um, it's this product called Even Wonder Lace spray my homegirl actually put me onto it so i want to try it and see what it's going to be given let me unbox <laughs> let me unbox this real quick silk satin wrap that i basically can use to lay my laces but lay my edges with and i love little mirrors like this i'm not gonna lie because i just use them when i got my little purse y'all know i'm a girly girl at heart also it comes with this little edgy brush you can never have too many edgy brushes so i'm just gonna brush everything back i was debating on if i actually wanted to do my lace my edge is a little bit different but for right now i think i'm okay with them but when i tell you this hair definitely did not disappoint far as the lace Ooh, so it is a lot that come out with this and i'm just laying it the hair the lace is extremely transparent this i'm not disappointed by the lace at all like the lace baby when i put it on she was definitely giving melted and you guys know what my wig installs i normally don't do all this but i really wanted to just show you guys the versatility of the wig like basically i was able to style the wig it came knots already bleached already pretty much plugged only thing i had to do was cut baby hairs in it and you guys see just how easy it was for me to style it and get natural realistic looking parts and then you have right now I'm about to show you guys how I can transform into even just a simplistic, classic style of, you know, everyday wear. Um, one thing about me, give me versatility on a wig every day, okay? Now the back, as you guys can tell, is already pretty much pre-pressed because, because it was straight from when I had my previous style. So I do just wanna run through it, but it will not be in the same capacity of how I'm going to be pressing the front. And I like to keep everything pretty simplistic because I'm like, child, I don't like a lot of products on my hair. And with this, I didn't really typically needed to use any. This hair I have been very impressed by compared to like hair I've had previously because it just presses out so nice and the lace is immaculate. And on top of that, it gives the girls a look. So let's see, go here, press this. Okay, it don't need, my, I'm telling you, this hair is like very impressive considering y'all know I do a lot of wigs, but so far in 2022, and this is a lot seeing it from me, this is my favorite wig from 2022 like hands down real but just by me see how it presses out
So yes, y'all, this is my final resort. I'm not gonna lie. I first did have a part. You guys know I do a lot of things with wigs. Like, don't get me wrong. But this one, the way she just melted on my forehead, like, let me give y'all the up close. So the way she just melted on my forehead, baby, I can't deny it. Like, of 2022, this is probably one of my favorite wigs just because I love the way it makes me look. Love everything about the wig. Like, it just looks really, really good. It looks really natural, I feel like. And on top of that, like, it's giving, it's serving. Okay, it's serving, and I also feel like it's very versatile. So, you guys, let me back up a little bit. Let me back up, because y'all on my profile. Let me back y'all up. Also, I want to show you guys another wig that's actually on their website, and it's extremely affordable. I believe it's like only $150, if I'm not mistaken. If I am, I will put that price right here, but this is extremely affordable. Um, You guys see it has this little bouncing, little bump at the back it's a bob wig so of course it's gonna be very easy to maneuver with and this one is also a part of my code if you use tay tay 25 percent off extra on top of that but this is a four by four closure and you know that is extremely easy to kind of put on and maneuver with especially if you're not really good at wigs but you can see through the lace right there just how transparent it is. It's already plucked pretty much. And then it comes with an elastic band on the inside of it just the way that this other one that I have on my head right now did. So they have some pretty good deals on there, pretty good wigs, a lot of versatility and a lot of variety on there. So the great thing about this also is if you guys are interested in purchasing this wig or the bob wig that I showed you guys earlier, all you have to do is use my code Tay, -Tay to get 25% off. And y'all know these companies be giving like 10 and 15% off, but this company said 25, love me hair said 25% off. So definitely use my code. Okay, you guys, so I know it might be a little confusing, but that wig you just seen, I'm now about to show you how I styled it into the knots. So first things first, I'm going to go through and put this um, line up onto my mannequin head. This is actually the line up of my actual wig head or my hairline per se. And this is just going to help me. So when I do the knots, basically I already know what tabs I'm cutting off so that I don't have to go back through. When I'm done with this wig, it should fit on my head perfectly, even with the ear tabs. And the way I did this is from using an old wig that already was cut out with my perfect hairline, put it on there, use a pin and cut it out, and then go back through and then use the marker just to darken it up so you guys could actually see it. And then, yeah, so this is where my exact hairline is. Now I'm going to do half up half down um this is just the easiest way you can do it at your own leisure and now i'm just going to play with the parting and see exactly how i want the parting to be done you guys see exactly how immaculate this scalp was made it already came bleach knots it already came pre-plugged which is perfect because it actually saves me time and money and effort so definitely keep that in mind when purchasing this wig these things will already be taking place and done and I'm just going to use my setting mousse and also use a little bit of my wax stick to go back through my hot comb and kind of ensure where my parts are and making sure they're perfect. It actually has a really good parting space on it as well. And then this is me just using a wax stick going through and using the hot comb and making my little ponytails. You can do this as many times as you need to. I know I went through and reworked it plenty of times because child, it was just not sometimes given what I needed it to give. Okay. Now I'm just going to go ahead and use my wrap strips and use this setting mousse that I got. It's something new I wanted to try out and then just basically wrap it up and then let it dry a little bit. Now this is some pack hair. We all know about pack hair. And I just wanted to add some to the ponytail so that my knots will be a little bit thicker. If you decide not to use them, your knots will just be thinner, but you still can kind of achieve the look. But with me, I definitely wanted to be thicker. And the pack hair was only 10 inches, but it doesn't really matter because once you twist it up, nobody's going to see it no way. So even if it is shorter sis it's cool it don't matter you don't have to go buy you the same amount of length that the wig is because ain't nobody got time for that now with this i'm glad i used the butterfly clips they actually will be linked in my amazon store i will have all that in the bio if you guys are interested but they help me to position and keep the little knots in place because some of the knots did typically want to unravel and i just made sure all the butterflies were facing forward so make sure you do that yeah, when so i know i look it. really really crazy and yeah, but that was now i'm about to go ahead and, and do my wig install. Is installing. so this is the wig that i actually ended up doing um this is how it finally looks so i'm about to go ahead and apply it to my hair now and yeah, just sit on my head. So first things first, I'm going to 
go through and put a little bit of glue on my forehead and then I'm going to just press it in. I'm doing a really thin layer because I'm just trying to make sure I'm laying the cap down because it was a little up but nonetheless it should lay effortlessly but once this dry I'm gonna put my second coat on and this is gonna be my coat that's gonna catch the hair and all the other stuff so yes right now because I don't got my comb I don't know where I put it And then I'm gonna take this band and wrap it. Well, okay, I'm running out of time, but I was like, let me hurry up and go ahead and finish this look. So, Loki, I want to just pull this off. <laughs> this little part is, I ain't gonna give a little sketchy, but everything else, is given period 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 and also the little clips i use i purchased them on amazon so if you guys are interested in those check them out yes it's given the hair is given the fit is given i'm glad i took that down because it's definitely given what's up I just had so much fun filming this look i love it so much i gotta go take me some bomb pictures the nails is giving everything is given also follow me on instagram as well because that's where i'm gonna post all my looks at so period Mwah. see ya <laughs>